These two smartphones have achieved some of the highest benchmark test scores in the world, but how do they stack up against each other in a real life speed test? The Xiaomi Mi 10 Ultra comes paired with the vanilla Snapdragon 865 processing chip, while the Asus ROG Phone 3 comes paired with the 865 Plus variant. They both have LPDDR5 RAM, though the ROG Phone has 12 gigs and the Xiaomi has 8 gigs. They both have UFS 3.1 storage as well. We have updated them to their latest available software. The ROG Phone sports 144 hertz, while the Xiaomi sports 100. 120 hertz panels. We have left animations on both devices over here under developer options. We also have OptiFlex enabled for the ROG phone to boost performance as well as that incredible X mode feature. Round one will be all about boot, fingerprints and face unlock. Round two will be all about initial opening of app speed and round three will be all about RAM management. We're going to be using my fingers over here so to keep things accurate we're going to pop GoPro footage at the bottom left hand corner. This is Technic and without further ado let's go! We're gonna start here with a simple boot to see which device can actually turn on their phone faster. 14.5 seconds for the ROG Phone 3 as opposed to 19.5 for the Mi 10 Ultra, getting the ROG its first points in round one. The Xiaomi quickly strikes back, getting it its first points in round one after refreshing the app icons first when going into the phone. We're testing out the optical fingerprint readers underneath the displays of both phones over here. It may seem like the ROG Phone is doing it quicker, but the Xiaomi actually shows the wallpaper quicker, which means that the fingerprint sensor, the actual raw speed of the finger print sensor is indeed faster so it picked up its second point in round one there however it is indeed the other way around when it comes to facial recognition the ROG phone 3 was faster three times out of three getting it, it its second point in round one moving on to round two of here making sure that we hook to the same Wi-Fi network the brightness is at the max level and there are no apps open in the background first app the ROG phone 3 opens up the camera app quicker the Xiaomi flips to the selfie camera quicker and the ROG phone 3 takes the snap quicker Going into gallery, the ROG Phone 3 opened it up quicker. Opening up a picture, the Xiaomi Mi 10 Ultra actually opened it up quicker, but the ROG Phone loaded the entire page quicker, so no point was allocated over there. Going into the calculator app, the ROG Phone 3 picks up its fourth point as opposed to the one point that the Xiaomi Mi 10 Ultra has, and picking up its fifth point after opening up the phone app. Opening up settings was too close to call, and the first non-system app that we have here is speed check and internet speed test. The ROG Phone 3 opens it up quicker. Now we're gonna run through the test. We're not checking out download and upload speed here per se, but how long it actually takes to get through the test. 21.5 seconds for the Mi 10 Ultra as opposed to 21 seconds for the ROG Phone 3. The ROG Phone 3 now six points ahead of the Xiaomi Mi 10 Ultra. And going into Spotify over here, the Xiaomi once again snaps back with its second point in round two. Next app that we have, Photoshop Express, in order to test out UFS 3.1 storage on both devices, the ROG Phone 3 opens it up quicker and goes into the picture quicker. Now we're gonna go ahead and export it using UFS 3.1 on both devices and the ROG set safe gallery at the bottom of the device quicker than it set it on the Xiaomi. Next app here is another app by Adobe, Adobe Premiere Rush, a video editing app. The ROG Phone 3 opened it up quicker. Now we're gonna go ahead and export this 4K 25 frames per second file and we're going to compress it down to 1080p and match the frame rate of 25 FPS, sped things up bottom right hand corner and we get the winner toward the Mi 10 Ultra with 14 seconds using UFS 3.1 storage same UFS storage on the ROG phone the ROG phone was noticeably slower that time around opening up Astral VPN since we need a VPN here in China the ROG phone 3 opened it up quicker and it was too close to call when enabling it going into our first social media app here which is Facebook one of the reasons why we need a VPN here in China the Mi 10 Ultra opens that one up quicker and loads the entire page faster as well however it is the opposite when we open up Instagram where the ROG phone 3 picks up its 13th point and the next app is indeed Twitter which the ROG phone now makes 14 points there going into YouTube, the Mi 10 Ultra was slightly quicker to open up the app and load it as well, getting it its fifth point in round two. Now we're gonna head over to my profile over here and jump into my silver play button video. Really happy that I got that recently. Make sure you check it out after this one, but the ROG Phone 3 is now on 16 points after going into my profile quicker and opening up the video faster and loading the page quicker as well. Going into Netflix over here, no surprise, the ROG Phone 3 was faster. Going into my profile, once again, ROG Phone 3 here, now with 18 points as opposed to just five on the Mi 10 Ultra. Google Chrome, similar thing can be said, it opened it up quicker and loaded the entire page faster via picking up its 19th point in round two. And the first game of four is indeed Subway Surfers. It is taking a bit long to load these days because of the new interface, but it's really surprising to me here that the gaming centric ROG Phone 3 didn't snag this point. It was indeed allocated to the Xiaomi Mi 10 Ultra, now getting it its sixth 
point. Next game over here is indeed flip diving and jumping into that one. Which one can pull it back? Will it be the gaming centric RG? No, once again, the Xiaomi opens up its second game faster than that of the gaming centric ROG Phone 3. Very interesting if you ask me and jumping into our next game, second last game over here, Temple Run 2. The ROG Phone finally responds and opens that game up quicker. Now getting it its 20th point in round two as opposed to just seven for the Xiaomi Mi 10 Ultra in round two. Last game over here, the longest loading, most graphics intense PUBG Mobile. 11.5 seconds is the quickest I've ever seen second to the iPhone that is. So picking up its 21st point in round two, closing off round two there with a win toward the ROG Phone 3 as opposed to just seven for the Mi 10 Ultra. Now we test out RAM management. It's not really all about the storage of the RAM. Eight gigs of RAM should have no problem keeping just 20 apps open in the background. However, Xiaomi tends to disagree. Their RAM management is absolutely terrible. Though I must say, I'm actually impressed with them this time round since the ROG Phone has only kept five apps open in the background where the Xiaomi has killed them. If both devices keep both apps open at the same time, then I do not allocate a point. And if they both kill an app, I don't allocate a point either. One of them has to keep it open, the other one has to kill it in order for a point to be allocated. So, so far the ROG has kept seven apps open where the Xiaomi has killed them and the rest of the apps that were not allocated over there were either opened by both, kept in the background, or were killed by both as well. It's very surprising to see that the last row of apps here, the Xiaomi has actually kept open. I did get a recent software update, so hopefully they are improving their RAM management ecosystem. Total score over here, nine points for the Xiaomi Mi 10 Ultra, as opposed to a whopping 21 point lead with 30 points on the ROG Phone 3. If we take raw speed into consideration here, that is indeed just round two, seven points for the Xiaomi and triple that, 21 points for the ROG Phone 3. I hope that you guys enjoyed watching this video as much as I did making it. This is Technic and I'll see you in the next one.